In this video, I wanted to show you a quick troubleshooting tip if you try to convert a CKPT file to a safe tensor and get an error message. Tried this a few times and ended up getting an error. What I ended up having to do to troubleshoot this was do the same process as I showed in the previous video where you're downloading your file. So for this example, Sibit AI, copy the link and you're gonna need the name as well. You're gonna paste the link, paste the name, hit download, it's gonna convert it. You're gonna add your name that you created for your Hugging Face account. The name of the model, try not to leave any spaces as I also encountered errors doing that. You're gonna press push, uh, I'm sorry, uh, once that's all completed, convert to safe tensors. Uh, in Hugging Face itself, you're gonna create a token. I showed you how to do that before. You're gonna paste it here, press push to safe tensors. Now, if you get an error, what you're gonna wanna do is go into your Hugging Face account and the models that you created, you'll probably see a folder. So I've done this a few times and I can show you how to do it, but essentially what you would do is you click on the file that you just made. Uh, there's no information for it. It's just gonna be under like your files and ver uh, versions. Uh, if the error is out, you'll probably see this and not the safe tensor file itself. So you're gonna wanna go under settings, scroll down. You're gonna wanna delete the file that, it was, that was just made. It's gonna ask you, are you sure you wanna do it? So yes, delete it. And then go back into the other hugging face uh, section to convert everything. You're basically like wiping everything out and then starting fresh, right? So you're deleting that folder that it made. Uh, you're gonna go back to the top. You're gonna make sure you press delete all again, refresh your page, and you're like starting from scratch. I did that and it worked for me. So maybe that can help you if you encounter an error code while trying to convert to a safe sensor. Anyway, I haven't been able to try that with these other ones, but if you do get an error, try that method as well. See if that helps you with the troubleshooting. Like always, be sure to like, subscribe, and I'll talk to y'all soon.